Hello and welcome to another edition of Beer Dad's Beer Reviews. Go to a beer from Tiny Rebel. This is a beer that I picked up out of the Mighty Bartons today. And it's this one. Wow, look at that. That's beautiful. This is Doom's Night. And apparently, this is an 11.5%. Although I could be wrong. In bed or stout. Everything, it's all. It's like, look at that. Every, all, the, all the writing on it just just fades. It's got the, the can again, just it's just so slick. Terry Rebel logo across the top here. It's deep grey on a black background. It's just, oh, I mean, that is just super smooth. Um, it cost me £6 after Mighty Bartons. Genuinely, genuinely don't know what, what the best before this one is. I genuinely think. Think the APV is eleven point five percent, but I can't see it because it's just ah. Anyway, let's pop a top. That's what we've got. This is one of these ones that uh, it's a it's a black right on a black background and a, and a it lights up with a black. I just, I just don't know what's going on with this beer. Let's go for it. Let's put it in. Ooh, look at that. Okay, so being a glass, where are we looking at? Jetpack beer. We've got a, a finger of hand head again I'm not at the light with the light coming in yeah but it still looks absolutely beautiful so let's get the nose and see what we can smell let's go for it most of malt dark chocolate dark fruit little hints of coffee here and there That's lovely. Right, let's go for the body and carb. Cheers. <clears throat> it's got a light to medium body. It's velvety. It's smooth. Combination is soft. <laughs> non existent. That's beautiful. Right, let's go for the big taste. Cheers. That's it. Uh, most of the malt straight up front. Milk, ch uh, milk chocolate. Dark chocolate. It then goes really, really bitter. It's really bitter. Like charcoal. Um, licorice. Smoke, even. Tobacco, even. And that thing is around for quite a while. It, it, it is a little bit of, I said, it is a little bit of black fruit, raisins, coconuts. The raisins, co coconuts were stupid. Raisins, black currants, blackberries. Dates, prunes, all I gave But it's still, it's still getting overridden by this woody tobacco finish. And it, it, it's, it's okay. Heavy going, if I'll be honest with you. It's chewy. As, I, as, I, as you get into it, it becomes chewy. Yeah, it's fruity. 
dark beauty would he oh. I don't know do I do, A bit of dark chocolate is quite nice. The the woody, the woody finish I wasn't expected, but as as you more you get into it, you think, okay, oh, that works. There's a little bit, I say, a little bit of coffee, a little bit of dark chocolate, dark fruit, prunes, leather. Actually, leather in there. It's okay. It's it, 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 it's all right. It's not too shabby. It's not. It's not great. But it's not. It's not too shabby. I think I've had, I've had better uh, imperial IPAs, imperial stouts. Sorry. Than this. Yeah, it's a little bit. Yeah, it's 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 okay. It's okay. So let's wrap this review up. Tiny Devils in. Um, Doom's Night. Jet Black Can. Do I like it? It's okay. Excuse me. Would I buy it again? I said quit a can. You know what? I might do. I might, I might do. Would I recommend to friends? Yes. I uh, just. Yes. It's. It's okay. It's not. It's not an eighth winner. Eighth winner. It's not a. It's not a, a world beater. There are better IPAs, stouts. Sorry, but but stouts than this. There are worse stouts than this. It's not, it's not too shabby. Um, so there you go. So if you had this beer, let me know what you think. Put a little comment in the comments box below. I will put a link to the Tiny Rebel uh, website also below. That is the video, if you don't, then subscribe in the bottom corner. Uh, got this out of buttons, if you pass it, get in there and, and crack, crack on and buy it. Buy it. And I'll see you in the next one. Hello.